Hello and welcome to CAD Drive. In this tutorial, we are going to see some essential shortcuts in Siemens and X which will improve your workflow and improve your time in Siemens and X. So, without wasting time, let's get started. The first short key we are going to see is Ctrl B. By pressing Ctrl B, uh, you can hide the objects, whatever you want, whether it is sketches or planes or any kind of bodies so let's get started uh, by, let's press ctrl b and you can see now the pop-up windows come let's hide this body and you can see now the body has been hided if you want to see the the slide or windows in which all your component sketches planes bodies hide it uh, you have to just press ctrl shift b you can see now see the windows in which all your body sketches coordinate system uh, that you are hide again pressing ctrl shift b will navigate through the regular working window you are working on so let's show the body please make sure the all short keys has been written in video description so don't worry about short keys so le again let's see an another short key the another short key is ctrl j by pressing ctrl j and selecting the object you can and now analyze your object by changing color changing the line width changing the transparency you can also change the color of this object and many more point setting face body setting wireframe display setting you can do many things more by pressing ctrl j short key another short key is ctrl shift i ctrl shift i is going to immediate hide the body you will select another short key is ctrl w by pressing ctrl w you can uh, hide and show from here the pop-up window if uh, you come here and select uh, uh, show and you can see now datum has been shown and come here hide column and you can see now datum has been hided so that's how simple now next short key is ctrl t by pressing ctrl t you can move the object now like this okay and next short key is ctrl f by pressing ctrl f you can fit your view in window let's play let's press ctrl f and you can see now the object is fit in this window next short key is alter enter by pressing alter enter the windows will go in full screen okay again pressing alter enter the windows will get regular next is uh, for layer setting press ctrl l you can see now layer setting pop up windows come you can manage your layers if you are working with uh, oil and gas industry hvac wiring harness it will make your work very friendly and easy if you are working with layers next short key is x by pressing x you can extrude the sketches or face whichever you want next short key is f8 f8 uh, what did uh, it will orient the normal view nearest to the your orientation so in this orientation side view is uh, almost uh, normal so uh, if you press f8 it will orient to orient you to side view now suppose this is uh, a front view let's uh, press f8 and you can see now it will orient you normal view according to your model's position next short key is w by pressing w you can see the w scissors this uh, green yellow and blue again pressing w it will hide uh, the wc uh, work coordinate system next short key is ctrl e by pressing ctrl e you can manage your expression table your formulas 
and many more if you are working with expressions next short key is control m by pressing control m it will navigate you through a modeling workbench by pressing control shift d it will navigate you a uh, drafting workbench by pressing control alter s it will navigate you the uh, general shape studio by pressing control shift m it will navigate you through sheet metal workbench by pressing control 1 you can customize the any commands whatever you want by pressing home button home short key you can orient your model into isometric view next short key is shift uh, f8 by, by pressing shift f8 it will uh, normal it will create a normal view if you are working in sketch uh, next short key is f6 by pressing f6 it will navigate through a zoom command and by dragging like this you can zoom like this uh, next short key is uh, control tab by pressing control tab you can navigate through Siemens NX uh, working tab like this where this is my model one this is my model two by pressing control tab now let's see uh, some short keys in sketches so let's get into sketch so first short key in sketch is Z by pressing Z you can navigate uh, you can directly get into profile command next short key is R by pressing R you will navigate through rectangle command this is my I can draw direct rectangle directly now by pressing R next short key is A by pressing A you will get into arc this is let's draw arc next short key is S uh, the S by pressing S, yes, you will navigate through symmetry for geometric constraint. By pressing L, you will navigate through uh, make perpendicular constraint. By making uh, pressing S, yes, you will navigate through symmetry. By pressing P, you will navigate through uh, parallel constraint. Uh, by pressing T, you can you are going to do trim short key. By pressing uh, E, by pressing E, you will navigate through extend command. By pressing F, you will navigate through fillet command. Like this. Next short key is D. By pressing D, you will uh, you will navigate through uh, rapid dimension. So let's dimension this. Click on OK next short key is c by pressing c it will, will pop up collinear window for your sketches let's collinear this and you can see now both line has been collinear next short key is control and drag by pressing uh, control and selecting dragging it it will create a copy of this line control and drag press control and drag this line and you can see now it will create your uh, multiple copies like this next short key is control q by pressing control q it you will be exit from sketch so that's all about uh, today's video thank you for watching please make sure you like share and subscribe this video thanks for watching